Hey, superstars, welcome to June. I said that like I own the month and I'm just letting you partake. That's not very nice. Let's try that again. Happy June, all you little June bugs out there. Oh, that didn't work either. Now I'm kind of condescending and calling you all cutesy wootsy little June bugs. Wow, I am a big jerk today. Uh, but this jerk's got some mail and some purchases from May that he wants to show off. Because not only am I a big jerk, I'm also a big show off. Uh, let's see some sports ball cards, shall we? Tony Black sent me something. We were talking recently about minor leagues and how it's been fun to see minor league games again. Uh, we've got some Heritage Miners Indians prospects. Lake County Captains George Valera. Uh, Mahoning Valley Scrappers Daniel Espino. Uh, Lynchburg Hillcats Tyler Freeman. He's in Akron now. Akron Rubber Ducks Dr. Sticks. And Nolan Jones. Very, very cool, Tony. These are sweet and you're sweet. Speaking of sweeties, Nina S. was in town and we got to hang out and that was a lot of fun. If you've not checked out Nina's channel, uh, you really should. She's a great storyteller and she's very fun and genuine. And uh, yeah, so we went to a couple local card shops and a card show. And if I was a good YouTuber, I would have taken some video, but I'm not, obviously. And uh, I just really wanted to hang out and enjoy what I was doing. So uh, at Triple Play, I bought myself this Russell Brannion autograph and Jared Wright, as well as this 62 Indians team card for the binder. Uh, at the card show, I picked up these 72 Laughlin Famous Feats. I've never really seen these before. They're a little rough, but they're very fun. Here is Cy Young, Nap Lajouet, and Tris Speaker. And... Nina gave me this very amazing T201 Mecca double folder with uh, Terry Turner on the front and George Stovall on the back. Such an incredible gift. Thank you so much, Nina. This is awesome. You know me, you know I only really collect Indians cards, so Project 2020 was cool, but none of it fit in my collection. Then they started Project 70, and it's been more Yankees, 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 with a smattering of Ichiro and whoever else is popular in the hobby. But they finally made an Indians card, so I can stop complaining now. Uh, there he is, Larry Doby by Chuck Stiles. Very, very cool. Now if they'd only make an Alvaro Espinosa card. I've been trying to fill in some of my favorite rookies from the Indians of the 90s. This month's focus was Sandy Alomar Jr. I picked up an autographed 89 upper deck and a nice PSA 10. Move over, Griffey. Speaking of 90s Indians, one of the most memorable events from my early collecting days was when Steve Olin died with Tim Cruz in a boating accident during spring training in 1993. Uh, this month I decided it was time to find his autograph. And the Stadium Club was the nicest card available. So I pulled the trigger. I'm very thrilled to add that one. And I love the 34 to 36 Diamond Star set. Very bold and colorful Art Deco designs. Just very cool cards. I picked up Hall of Famer Sam Rice. Rice played mostly for the Washington Senators. But he finished up his career in Cleveland. Super cool card. I have the Earl Averill. And I'm waiting on another Diamond Stars card now. So I guess I'm actively working on this team set. And I want to give a shout out to Andy over at Nostalgic About Baseball, who sold me another big card in my collection, this 1953 Topps Bob Feller. I've been after this card for a little while now, so I was excited to get that from him. That completes my Topps Bob Feller run. Here is the 51, 52, 53, and 56. I've got a couple of the Bowman cards, but I've got a few more to find. So thanks for the assist, Andy. I don't think I mentioned that last one to Mrs. Reindeer. So if you're watching, babe, Andy did give me a really, really good deal on that one. So uh, I am going on a little spending hiatus. I had a lot of work done in my car recently, and uh, I want to save up some money for the national. Um, so no more eBay for me for a little while, unless something really, really crazy pops up. Um, I got a couple boxes of 91 Bowman to rip, so maybe I'll open a pack a day just to scratch that itch, you know? 
Before I go, I want to wish all of you a very great summer. I think it's going to be absolutely amazing. Uh, we've all been through so much this past year, and uh, making videos has been very therapeutic for me. And so many of you um, have reached out and said that I've given you something to smile about, and that just means the world to me. So don't take anything for granted. Uh, enjoy each other, your friends, your family, your neighbors, uh, everybody. Um, and if that means watching less YouTube or buying less sports cards or making less videos, so be it. Uh, it doesn't matter. Uh, be safe, of course, and uh, we can all live life a little bit again. So enough sappy stuff. Big thanks and shout outs to Tony Black, Nina S, and Eat Nostalgic About Baseball, and all you guys for watching. Much love, guys. See you real soon.